welcome back to my channel playing like a queen so today's video is going to be my very first Fobonichi Friday yes y'all say it with me Fobonichi I am super freaking excited so yeah I've never played with my Fobonichi ever on camera so I'm super excited to do this video you guys also if you guys have not noticed I have started Fobonichi Friday over on Instagram already I actually was going to do my first Fobonichi Friday video um, last week but I decided to wait until this week this current Friday because it was a new month and a new series that I wanted to start on my channel so I just wanted everything to be new and fresh for you guys and I what I do for my Fobonichi Fridays will be you will be seeing my upcoming week of like what I've already how I planned like my before the pen of upcoming week so every Friday you will see a new spread for the upcoming week and it will be before the pen now if you guys want to see after the pen um, spreads let me know in the comments down below or let me know over on Instagram so I can kind of figure out what you want to see I've been doing classic after the pen spreads and I have loved that so anyways you guys it's Fobonichi Friday and I am too freaking excited to get it done so if you guys don't know what a Fobonichi is I basically am using a happy planner half sheet notebook to replicate or duplicate the um, Hobonichi notebook that are Hobonichi weeks I think it's called that everybody is running around using I personally love using the disbound system so I decided to turn my half sheet notebook into a Fobonichi and I, it's a good way for me to be able to bujo every week um, or just be creative this is like my space to really be creative sometimes um, and what I keep in my Fobonichi you guys is I keep my hello happy notes in here I keep video ideas of new current things that I want to get done for my channels in here and then I keep throughout the week is like daily priorities three things that I want to get done every day so it's one to three things every day I can come here and focus on that one thing whatever it is if it's just a filming day okay what two videos am I trying to film today or what video am I trying to get accomplished today um if it's meetings with um hello happy or anything like that I make sure to put that in there so yeah I definitely try to keep things you know super super easy for myself because I know that sometimes when I have a bunch of things lined up in my classic planner it's kind of like okay girl it's overwhelming what do you need to get done get your to-do list out what are your three priorities for today and let's get this stuff done so yeah and being your own businesswoman sometime being an entrepreneur you guys it is not easy because you have to be your own motivation and sometimes that can be a little tricky especially when you don't feel good you still have to work sometimes so I I try my best to get this thing on and popping, but yeah, I definitely love having my Fobonichi for that. I, sometimes I keep it to jot ideas in, um, and then of course I also still have my mini planner, which I use for on the go, and I keep things in like bills and track things that I need to get done. Um, definitely in my mini planner. So these two things I usually try to throw in my purse when I'm leaving um, the house. I absolutely love them. They my Fobonichi is my life I love it love it love it love it and it's so fun to use every week so with that being said you guys if you guys want to see me get into planning into my Fobonichi then just keep watching okay Royal Gang so what I like to do for my Fobonichi I have already started setting up my August as you guys can see this is what the cover is going to look like and then I gotta add my decorations in and then here is my monthly and I still want to finish decorating this shout out to southern tea time she gave me a really bomb idea i had been struggling with my monthly and i finally was able to figure out some stuff so girl i thank you it is not perfect but hey it is way better than what i had going on so i want to shout out her and if you guys want to check out her channel i will try and link that down below for you guys um southern tea time she's such a sweetheart so you guys definitely need to check her out um yeah i have really been enjoying her channel like i found her on instagram and you guys i'm gonna try to start talking about girls that i've found Found on Instagram or on YouTube but I think I found her actually on YouTube and I started watching her videos just been watching binge watching and you guys I love her she I love her name Southern Tea Time you know I'm from the south so you know honey okay we all about that tea that sweet tea honey so yeah I absolutely love her name and I love that she calls people that her tea party squad you guys and I don't know she's a girl after my own heart because when I was a little girl I played tea party so much like I'm I'm a grown-up but um honey can I have a birthday tea party like that would be so bomb like me and my friends having an actual real life tea party okay like 
I don't know. I just think that's so bomb. But anyways, <laughs> you guys, you definitely should go check out her channel because she gave me some bomb ideas. And she does Nietzsche Saturday, you guys. Her with an, a few other girls. I think Jasmine Silver Plans. You guys should check them out. When I started my um, Fobonichi planning, I didn't want to step on anybody's toes. So I decided to do Fobonichi Fridays. And they have Nietzsche Saturdays. And I think that's really cute. So make sure you check them out, you guys, because they do inspire me all the time. Especially Jasmine and Southern Tea Time. I really love watching their videos um yeah and i think we should start shouting more girls out that we enjoy their channels um and spread the love here in this community so i hope to kind of spark something in you guys to share the love in your in the community and start sharing other planner babes that you love so with that being said you guys we're going to go ahead and jump into the planning um i've already pulled my pages off the disc you know you guys know how your girl likes to plan honey i like to pull my pages off now i also got some washi which is this black washi because i think i want to do something a little different I normally draw my lines but I think I'm gonna use this washi for that I got my trusty wax paper because y'all know last time I planned I know some lemons on here and that is from my classic spread from earlier this week um and I haven't just taken them off yet so what I'm gonna actually use this week though for this spread if you guys can't already tell I want to do a wrong wrong spread so I pulled three of my wrong wrong sticker books I have the multi-pack then I have the um accessory book and then I have the everyday book so I pulled all three of these because I have a little idea in my mind what I want to do and I want to go ahead and pull my stickers off and put them here on my um wax paper and then I also want to go ahead and do my lines for my um, weekly side over here and then you know do a little decoration I think this is going to be really really cute this is actually my first um, wrong wrong spread in my Fobonichi so I'm super freaking excited about it and I'm oh I can't wait to plan so if you guys are ready to plan with your girl go ahead get your coffee your tea whatever you need honey your planner supplies your pens everything girl grab that planner and let's get to it
Rong Gang, so this is my finished spread. You guys, I absolutely love the Rong Rong stickers and the sticker books. I use, actually, this is a half sheet from the Rong Rong um, collection. And you guys, I thought it was super cute. And I was like, okay, I'm going to use these two sheets to create my little um, Fobonichi spread this week. And I think it turned out super duper freaking cute. I am going to show you guys the sticker books that I use. So I did use this Rong Rong accessory book. I also use the Wrong Wrong Every Day. This one is the classic. I don't have the mini one. I have got to look for that one. But this one is the classic. And then I have this Wrong Wrong multi pack. And I think I used maybe one sticker out of here. I'm not sure, you guys. I can't remember. I don't think I did, but I did pull it to um, actually use stickers. And then I pulled out three other random little sticker books that I realized I needed when I was planning so I actually grabbed the OG colorful boxes I also grabbed my journaling sticker book and then I also grabbed the um, happy memory keeping one because it has the it's the dates and holidays and I needed the dates to um, date my planner and then I also with the journaling one I use the actual days of the week out of here to put the days of the week here so I thought this was really really cute I love the way it turned out like Oh, such a cute little spread. Y'all see, I got my little girl crossing the street, honey, with her little street sign up here. Y'all, I absolutely love the way this turned out. It's very cute, very simple, very fun and functional. I love it. So, if you guys are loving Fobonichi Friday, definitely comment down below and definitely thumbs this video up. And you guys know that I love my Fobonichi and I have got, okay, I have got to have this thing in my life. Like, this is like one of my favorite things to use every week. Um, and I love planning in here. You know, it gives me a chance to be able to bujo and be a little bit more creative. And I absolutely love it. If you guys are looking for a half sheet notebook, you can find most of them either on the Happy Planner website or you can find them over at Hobby Lobby. I actually picked mine up at Hobby Lobby and I absolutely love this little thing. It's super freaking cute cute and again the one that I have is the one that says I'm a happy planner yeah but this spread just turned out super duper cute so I'm going to go ahead and get out of here you guys but before I go don't forget to thumbs up this video if you are not subscribed go ahead and subscribe and make sure you click the notification bell because you never want to miss a video from your girl okay never ever we got some good things coming up okay and make sure you tell a friend to tell a friend to subscribe okay because once we get to 500 we are going to be having a great giveaway not only just happy planner stuff but we're going to have some of my favorite things that I love to plan with put into a giveaway and one look lucky winner will get to win it all so go ahead and subscribe you guys and make sure you tell your friends to subscribe as well and with that being said i'm going to go ahead and get out of here but before i do remember be bold be brave be you i will see you guys in another video bye